Oh, sh**. What time is it? It's time for the Royal Goose. Hey, Elliot. Hey, what? I bet I can stick more dicks up my vagina than you can. Oh, nice, Edgelord. I can put up six. Wow. How many can you put up? Oh, one. Oh. Yeah, I'm better than you. <laughs> nice joke. <laughs> hey, everybody, welcome back. Hi. I'm here today in the sixth grade class with my boy Slick Frame, where we play the vagina game. Every time oh, you yeah. say something funny, just add vagina to it, dude. Oh, you're referencing Metroid Prime, <laughs> aren't you? Oh, yeah. The... Want to play this hilarious game? Okay, it's a little next level, so strap on your thinking caps, bitches. Here we go. <laughs> Let's see. Super <laughs> Mario World 2, Yoshi's Vagina. <laughs> uh, no. See. Yeah, no. No, no. We, we discuss this. Yeah, it's we, not as funny. We discuss as this. this! It's Got too a... funny for me! I can't handle it! I don't think DK can come in there. I think Diddy has to. Uh, yeah. And we need to unlock some other people first. So I need to get DK, and then we need... Or, a Diddy Kong. Then we need to get that uh, sweet rock out sickness and then go on top of the camel cage let the camel out and then the gate opens i think i think you have to uh let's see i think you have to be dk jump on the tree get on the vines swing across to the top of the camel cage and there's a switch that only dk can hit i think i think the barrel blast stage might be there huh I remember that we have to go on top of the camel cage with Diddy and then play the guitar and it lets him out of the cage. Okay. All right. Well, let's let's find out next time on Dragon Ball Z. Dragon, dragon, up the dragon. Dude, that reminds me. I saw this really funny bit from Dragon Ball Z on yeah. YouTube recently. Uh huh. I I recently have gotten into this habit of looking up funny anime compilations. Just moment. Yeah. Last time you were here. Oh yeah, baby. Yeah, I was telling you about you that see last this? time. Oh, you're right. Yeah. That's another reason Diddy's the best. He's got a freaking guitar. And he's got his dual wielding peanut pop guns. <laughs> peanut poppers. I knew it. Yep, it's a barrel blast stage where that we free the llama. On uh, another oh, part oh, of the to level. To free him. Yeah, to free him. Roger it's Roger. Roger Roger Donger. Um and so yeah, like it was just a moment of like funniest confessions of love in anime. Oh, yeah, like you showed me this last time you were here. Or like marriage proposals or stuff. Or uh -huh. stuff. Some, a lot of them are, you know, failures <laughs> and stuff. But uh, what's the name of the girl who likes Goku? She has the black hair. Girl who like you mean his wife? I don't, I don't remember. But Chi Chi. Yeah, Chi Chi. That's a, his wife. Well, well, it was like in an earlier part of okay, the show, okay, I okay. guess. There's a part where she's like, Goku, you promised that you would marry me. He was like, what? And then it flashes back to when they were toddlers, mm -hmm. and they're flying on something, and he, he kind of, like, kicks her in the crotch, and he's like, wow, you don't have a wiener, you must be a girl. <laughs> so then she smacks him off, and then she's she's all mad, but then she goes like, oh, he kicked me there, I bet he wants to marry me. <laughs> <laughs> See, I never watched Dragon Ball Z, so I don't, I don't know very much about it. Mm. From what I have seen, I, I recall it being a pretty awesome show, though. Yeah, it's sick, dude. The little bits that I have seen. It's a good show. And they're still making it today, aren't they? Um, no. Well, yes and no. They're making, like, new versions. There was Dragon Ball, then there was Dragon Ball Z, and then there was, like, Dragon Ball Z something. Dragon Ball GX or something? Yeah, yeah, GT. There's, like, Dragon several different versions. And then they remade Dragon Ball Z with Dragon Ball Z Kai, which is just kind of like a shorter version. Mm. Um... And it's just retouched and remastered. They kept most of the same original soundtrack. Is, oops, you know I'm gonna forget. Hold on. Give me DK. Yeah, let's go get this. Good thinking. And I can get these balloons. Balloons. Didn't they make a new Dragon Ball Z movie for theaters a few years ago? Uh, there's one in theaters like right now, I think. Wait, seriously? I think so. Really? Yep. Oh well, I wouldn't know. I got invited to go see one the other day, Strong in theaters. Um, Strong Young Congress. Oh, this is the the one where they. Invincibility. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. I thought I, it was the lever pulling one, mean but no. I didn't mean to uh, do that. No, it's okay. But yeah, there were other funny moments in that compilation too. I, I can't think of them off the top of my head, but I'll share them later if I feel like it. <laughs> <laughs> they're they're really funny. I I just love how anime like a lot of it's cool because anime they're cartoons. But they're not, like, 
necessarily like aimed at kids like a lot of western cartoons are mm -hmm. like i there's a lot of western cartoons that are for kids and adults whereas anime there are so many that lean a bit more towards adults a bit more shonen uh and i would say that dragon ball z is a shonen and like things like naruto and crap those are all uh aimed more at like middle school to early high school mm. are you hot yeah, I'm a little hot right now. Oh. <laughs> I was like, just, like took up my throw pillow on my couch and was fanning himself. It was pretty funny. Well, I just had a I just had a little container of hot macaroni and cheese, so Oh yeah, that's probably why you're hot. And I also took off my socks to so you know. I'm trying to cool down. I see. I was really angry. I was kinda angry in the car yesterday with my dad and grandma. They were like I was like, Dad, can you please turn the heat down? He turns it down by like two degrees. And it does not make a difference at all. Oops. I'm like, Dad, Dad. All right. You wouldn't like my car. No. No. Normally I blast the heat max mm. all the time. Oh, yeah. I would be pretty mad. Oh, yeah. <laughs> this is another reason Diddy's oh, the best. Shite. You got a freaking jetpack. Does Donkey Kong have a jetpack? No. <laughs> Fucking bitch. Leader of the bunch, more like leader of the bitches. <laughs> yeah, that's not really an insult. <laughs> Jen just snorted. <laughs> Scoffed. Not Scoffed. Snorted. snorted is this. <laughs> oh. Did you hear you say that? And go <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's what a <laughs> scoff is? Where you go no. like. <laughs> no, a scoff is like. <laughs> oh, that's okay. That's a scoff. Oh. I didn't know. There you go. Huh. The more you know. Oh, sweet. Time to. Fly against the vulture, dude. Yeah, bro. Oh, so so we were talking about this last episode. Um. Oh, dude, we didn't go to save Tiny. Nope. Ooh, we got to do that at some point. Um. Yeah. We can't yet. No, we can. Uh, no. Yeah, you remember that big temple that you were walking around by the llama? Yeah, you need to get in there with. Uh, I'm pretty sure you need to use Lanky's uh, grape to hit. The side. <laughs> there was a thing for a grape. There's a thing for Diddy too. Oh, so you... Oh, I see. You can hit one of them. Yeah. You don't have to hit all of them. Yeah, you... you don't I just need to follow him? Yeah, just follow him. You have to fly through the rings. Um, yeah. Okay, so last episode, I was talking about uh, New Super Mario Brothers U and how it's just not pushing the envelope or moving Mario forward at all. I think we might have been talking about that off camera. Was it on camera? I... No, it was on camera. Okay. Um. So, yeah, I wanted to contribute to that. I actually recently... Rented a uh, Yoshi's oh. Woolly World. Shit. Okay. Did you ever play that game? No. Mm. Mother effer. It's it's a lot like the previous Yoshi games. It's just the visuals are different. It's like all handcrafted and woolly and right. yarn based. I'm it's excited for the new game, mother. <sighs> Try it again, baby. Frickety frack. Yeah, no, I I thought it was decent overall. Like, mm -hmm. I, a, a few years ago... Oh, I, are you kidding me, dude? <laughs> what the F? This is what happened last time, and then I got behind just from having to get the barrel. All right, all right. You got it. No. You dude, missed this thing the is so ring. This thing is so hard to control. Yeah, it's... Don't forget you can hold Z to just hover in place. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah, it's very Whoa, useful. Whoa, that was lucky. <laughs> yeah. Um, but, you know, I, I thought it was decent overall. It, it wasn't great... Uh, a lot of people seem to like it, though, so I I'm glad for that. Cool. The Yoshi's Island games have been kind of uh... hit or miss over the years, supposedly. Like, a lot of people don't like Yoshi's Story, because, like, after Yoshi's Island, just a huge game with 64 levels or something, they mm -hmm. came Yoshi's Story, a much tinier game. Oh, wow, that's it? Uh-huh. Oh, wow, that was easy. Huh. And then there was Yoshi's oh, Island. Oh, yeah. <laughs> but you like Yoshi's Story, right? Yeah, I like Yoshi's Story. I do too. That, that was the first game I played uh, in the Yoshi series, so uh, I doubt I'd like it today as much if I played it for the first time, but you know. No, no, I don't think I'd like it very much if I played it for the first time today. Nah, it's... Mm. But yeah, so, um, you know, I'm, I'm interested to see how uh, Yoshi's Crafted World is going to turn out. Because I know, like, you can, uh, after you beat levels, you can play through them backwards. Oh, weird. Yeah. So, uh, I'm excited to see if they do anything new, because I feel like 2D platformers for the past decade or so have kind of hit a wall, in that they haven't really advanced that much. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, I don't know. They're... Oh, he's still working on his next thing. Oh, 
Okay, yeah. so you think we can get tiny now? Yeah, we can get tiny now. Fucker! <laughs> Stop it! Clap trap. <laughs> I'd say my least favorite, even though I said I like all the levels, I think my least favorite level in this game is the next one. Oh, uh, Frantic Factory? Oh, sorry, no. Fourth level then. Uh, Gloomy Galleon. Yeah. Gloomy oh, really? Galleon. Yep. Yeah, it's a water level. Eh, it makes yeah. sense. <laughs> Nobody likes water levels. No. I will say, though, the water levels in uh, Donkey Kong Tropical Freeze are actually pretty solid. Yes, they are. They are. I they're, like them. They're good because you don't have to constantly just hit A to just go up, 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 yep. up. You actually use the control stick and change the direction you swim, and that feels so much better. That feels so good. It feels really good. So good. There you go. See? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I saw this before. I was just saying I thought I needed to hit all four to Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Or all however many. Nope, nope. All right, let's go save Tiny Kong. Whoa. That was one of the blueprint dudes. Oh, okay. I think he's on top of the building. All oh, right. Wow. She's a little bit tinier than normal. You really think she can't walk through those bars? <laughs> those bars are freaking huge. <laughs> Huh. Okay, then. <laughs> I, I like this part. This part's fun. Ice. But, you know, I would like to play Tropical Freeze on the show at some point. Yeah, that'd be fun. I know we've talked about that before. I, I agree, though. It would be good. Yeah, that's a fun game. Plus, you and I just need to play a co-op platforming game. Yes. <laughs> we haven't done... I was I was thinking it might... If it goes on Super Sale, I might even pick it up on Switch. Like, really? I have it on um, Wii U, but I don't know. It's probably better experience on Switch. Hmm. I mean, it's pretty much the exact same game. The only addition is that you can play as Funky. And he, he's kind of like the easy mode. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah. He doesn't get hit by enemies as easily, I think. And then you can hover with him with his surfboard. Whoa. Oh, oh geez. Oh, geez. <laughs> Rock out with your ween out. Speaking of that, I Snapchatted a bunch of my friends today when I was taking a pee. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, that's a triangle. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I, I saw that picture that you sent Jen. Yep. <laughs> Should we share it on on the on the screen? No, it's a Snapchat and no. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Elliot just, he, while he was peeing, he aimed the camera up towards his face and he made a ridiculous face. And he was like, I'm the, peeing. I, I was like, I be peeing. <laughs> some of my yeah. friends thought it was funny. Some of them were like, what the fuck, dude? <laughs> do, do, are some of your friends not as like down with that kind of humor? Uh, yeah, probably. I mean, I don't think any of them were pissed, or I wouldn't have sent it to them. Most of them are pretty chill. I think they're just like, okay, weirdo. <laughs> yeah, I know. The, knowing you, I mean, you definitely have to have those kinds of friends that are cool with that stuff. Yes. All right. Well, uh, we have 13 minutes in, so uh, next time on Royal Goobs. Next time on Royal Goobs, I play the triangle.